every week is Pride Week in my life. But I guess in July it's Pride Week here, so. Yeah, I would say just a message for anyone who's struggling or anyone who is not struggling is just keep being yourself and keep spreading love. My biggest thing in life is that just to live every day with the most compassion and the most kindness that I can. I always knew I was gay, and although I was really confident, it was a struggle because I just, it, I was a little unsure of myself. I didn't really know what I was feeling. And so, you know, I, I came across as confident and put together, but there were times where I was alone, where I was just so confused and, and, um, and upset. So I try to live life here and outside the gym, just like giving everyone my 100%, like giving everyone love and light not judging anyone. I just want everyone to feel welcome and accepted no matter where they go. I think the biggest struggle that I have had over the last decade is that um, there's still that stigma of you don't look like a lesbian. Like, this looks like a lesbian to me because inside I sure do feel like one. Um, so that was a, a tough thing for me is that people are like, are you sure? Are you sure you like women? Like, yes, I am very 100% sure I love women. I love them. So I would say if you're coming from somewhere where maybe like there's not that much support or you're nervous, find at least one person that you know you can confide in. I always say if you don't get it off your chest, you're going to be suffocating forever. So when I carried around inside of me, like I knew I wanted to date women. I knew that I liked women. I just didn't know how to approach it. And when I finally said those words, like I'm gay, it was like, ah, like literally rainbows shot out of the air. And it was amazing. And I felt a lot lighter. And here we are a decade later.